Good Monday morning, siblings in Christ. I am Pastor Barb Street, one of the assistants to the Bishop of the Southeastern Minnesota Synod Office, and it's really good to be with you this Monday morning. Well, as we enter this week, many of us are thinking about Thanksgiving. We think about what we've been taught about Thanksgiving, how we've maybe celebrated Thanksgiving in the past, and probably what Thanksgiving will look like this year. Many of us have an ideal of what Thanksgiving should be. Unfortunately, when it comes to the history of Thanksgiving, generations of Americans have known a one-sided history of Thanksgiving. But there are always two sides to every story. Today for my devotion time, I would like to share with you another perspective or side. And this side is shared by an organization called Native Hope, a nonprofit organization whose work centers on dismantling barriers through storytelling and impactful programs to bring healing and inspire hope in Native communities. So the mainstream version of Thanksgiving, of that Thanksgiving story paints a picture of courageous Christian settlers braving the perils of the new world and with the help of some friendly natives, finding a way to make a new life for themselves. Now, I remember as a young child, as a student in the days surrounding Thanksgiving, making American Indian headdresses out of construction paper and holding Thanksgiving reenactments in our classrooms. That was one side of the story. It wasn't until much later in my life that I took the time to learn that there is another side to the story. And this truth makes Thanksgiving a very complex holiday and one that all of us should approach with greater sensitivity. So I bring to you some um, readings from Native Hope. It's important to know that for many Native Americans, Thanksgiving is a day of mourning and of protest since it commemorates the arrival of settlers in North America and the centuries of oppression and genocide that followed. Quote, Thanksgiving Day is a reminder of the genocide of millions of Native American people and the taking of Native lands and the relentless assault of Native culture. Some Native Americans mourn publicly, publicly and openly, while some simply refrain from participating in this national holiday. While some Native Americans have chosen to reject the Thanksgiving holiday entirely, some embrace the positive messages of the holiday and choose to put aside thoughts about the complex history of the day. This is because the idea of giving thanks is central to Native heritage and culture. And in this way, Thanksgiving is simply a chance to appreciate the good things of life, like family, community, the riches of the land. Long before settlers arrived, Native tribes were celebrating the autumn harvest and the gift of Mother Earth's abundance. Native American spirituality, both traditional and today, emphasizes gratitude for creation, care for the environment, and the recognition of the human need for communion with nature and others. Thanksgiving as a holiday originates from the Native American philosophy of giving without expecting anything in return. At Native Hope, they say, we hope that this Thanksgiving the hearts of all people, Native and non-Native, are filled with hope and healing and a desire to dismantle the barriers, physical, economic, educational, psychological, and spiritual, that divide us and oppress us. Friends, November is Native American Heritage Month, and so we give thanks for our Native American siblings in Christ, and we pray for that day when all barriers that divide and oppress the people of God be dismantled. And as we pray in the Lord's prayer, thy kingdom come, 
thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven.